In order to use anamorphic D-squeeze with the FX3 and the new firmware 3.00, scroll to the bottom of the menu to Setup and to Display Option. There you can find the option to D-squeeze Display, currently 1.3 times and 2 times. If you set that, the display is adjusted accordingly. Important here, the 2x D-squeeze cuts off something from the image on the right and left side and shows an aspect ratio of 2.67 to 1. With a D-squeeze of 1.3 times, nothing is cut off and the aspect ratio is 2.3 to 1. All this only concerns the display on the camera. The recorded files are all original 16x9 full frame. The situation is slightly different when it comes to the HDMI output. If under External Output in the HDMI output settings, Rec Media during HDMI output is on, then the external HDMI signal is just as de-squeezed as the display on the FX3. However, if you set the HDMI setting Rec Media during HDMI output to off, the external output is not affected by the de-squeeze. This is also the case when you record externally in RAW. The drawback, if you press record on the camera, the indicator lights up red as if the camera is recording, but that is not the case. Thus, only the record start signal is passed on to the external recorder in this mode. All in all, a great step in the right direction for Sony, but a bit cumbersome and not the most versatile solution.